Hi, it's Jen with Formula Fun, and I had a question today by one of my lovely customers who purchased one of my products, the Combine Like Terms Anchor Charts and Flippables, and she wanted to know how to put it together. So here I have that product right here in front of me, and I've printed it all out, and I'm going to do a quick little video on how to put this together. So this product comes with three different items for an interactive notebook. There are two flippables and then one just interactive learning tool. This first flippable is basically a cootie catcher. Um, sometimes, and as you can see on this one, it didn't print um, extremely well with the formatting and that's what I wanted to show you. Sometimes it won't. Um, so what I normally do is I use the second page and then I simply just cut on the dashed lines. The great thing is this is two per page so I can get two kids um, assignment with one piece of paper and then this can be used this one can be used for just almost anything but this is for combined like terms and now you have a cootie catcher and you can simply fold your flaps into the center just like all the cootie catchers you made growing up Okay, so that's that one. This other flippable is the like terms and unlike terms. And this is actually a flippable that I have created before that I just recently redid um, to where you can print it double-sided. So to print it double-sided, you'd need to make a copy of both pages, then put it into your copy machine to where it would print to where basically it was like this on one side and this on another side. And then, once it's that way, again, you've got two kids per each piece of paper. Okay, that's the great thing. And this is meant to be your title part. So when this folds over, and this is the hard part about doing it back to back. Okay, it's gonna have to be like this, sorry. That's how it needs to be, because it needs to fold over like this. Okay? So when you're printing it back to back, make sure the back side's flipped upside down. So I'm going to go ahead and trim this. Another great way is you can just print the one page, and then they can decorate their cover for the other page once they fold it uh, to the line. That's what I like to do, because my kids like to decorate their covers with flippables. So if you're doing that, you would simply just have them fold to here, and then you can kind of see that line right through there. So then they would just cut up like this. And then they would have their combining like terms flippable already created with some information inside. So that way you simply just have to add in your example and a little bit extra and I've got a copy of where that one came from here in my handout this is actually both of these flippables right here see I made the cootie catcher with them and we talked about uh, different words that mean add subtract multiply and divide and then I have my like terms and unlike terms flippable for simplifying expressions this information is provided and we went through and gave several examples. We did problems up there and we simplified them. Problems up there and then we simplified them. And this is when um, I showed them an example of a trip to the grocery store. So on my trip I bought two apples, three kiwi, and six bananas. And on my husband's trip he bought four apples, two kiwi, and four bananas. I can add apples and apples kiwi and kiwi and bananas and bananas but I can't add apples and bananas so that was our running joke is apples and bananas can't be added unless you're calling them fruit instead of their each individual self and then their post-it prove it at the end of the day that day was to write an expression and simplify so that was to prove that they knew what was going on in class now this next little activity move some of the stuff out of the way basically a one-step equations wheel and I wanted them to practice solving one-step equations so I give them four different equations that I want them to work out on this paper 
and it models this right here, an equation wheel that we created, and I had them create their own. Well, that was a little bit too difficult for some of them, so I wanted, this is more of a uh, introductory version of it. So we go through and we model these and they just cut this part out and they glue that in their interactive notebook. So that is comparing and solving equations, combining like terms with uh, like terms and unlike terms. Great thing is you can just use this one. And then the cootie catcher for um, the different uh, keywords that we'll have. So I hope this solves some of your problems with the flippables that I have, and I hope to add pictures to each of these products this summer. Hope you're having a great day, and goodbye.